How to configure rate limit on Wagia Cloud. Wagia Cloud supports four types of rate limiting, user rate limit, wireless rate limit, AP rate limit, and packet rate limit. For the same terminal, if multiple rate limiting methods are configured, the priority is user rate limit, wireless rate limit, AP rate limit. To configure on Wagia Cloud official website, enter your cloud account and password to log into Wagia Cloud. Click Devices and then click Wireless under the Rate Limit option to enter the configuration interface for Wireless Rate Limit. The switch for Wireless Rate Limit is turned on by default. Due to conflicting functions, the traffic control feature needs to be turned off first. Using the User Rate Limit feature, you can specify terminal devices and set speed limits for both uplink and downlink traffic. Click plus button to input MAC address of a terminal and set uplink slash downlink speed limits. You can also add a description for this terminal. If you want to modify the restriction settings for this terminal later, click change. If you want to cancel the speed limit setting for this terminal at any time, simply click clear followed by OK. Wireless rate limit allows setting speed limits specifically associated with STAs in a designated SSID network. Select the group that the AP belongs to. On the wireless page interface, you can see all SIDs within that network. Select an SSID that needs configuring and click change button to enter into its configuration page where upload slash download rates will be limited. Per user rate limit means all terminals associated with this SSID use uniform limitation rates. Shared by all users means average sharing of limitation values among all users associated with this SSID. Choose a mode of rate limiting and set maximum value accordingly, after completion, set it as saved. If you want to cancel restrictions made earlier, you may do so by clicking clear followed by OK. AP, Access Point, Rate Limit provides whole network-based device rate limiting function. All devices connected under such networks will use the set rate limit value. If you want to set upload or download speed limits, simply turn on the switch and set the maximum rate limit value. After completion, click Confirm. If you want to turn off the transmission rate limit, simply click Confirm after turning off the switch. Packet rate limit can be used to limit downlink broadcast and multicast packets transmission rates. If your network is still lagging even when there are no high traffic terminals present during normal internet usage, it is recommended that you adjust within 1 kbps 512 kilobits per second range. The smaller the rate value, the more obvious improvement in network performance. To configure restrict broadcast packets, Click Restrict All to restrict both ARP packets and DHCP packets simultaneously. Click Restrict All to restrict both ARP packets and DHCP packets simultaneously. To configure Restrict Multicast Packets, click Restrict Part to select MDNS packets or SSDP packets. Alternatively, click Restrict All to restrict both MDNS packets and SSDP packets simultaneously. After configuring restriction settings for packet limiting as desired, click Confirm. To follow this issue, comment on our video or send an email to us. See you in the next video.